welcome to week three of our minimalism challenge. We are doing this for the entire year of 2019. I'm sorry that I sound totally crazy. I am sick right now at the time of this recording and my voice is gone. But if you're interested in these kind of videos, please subscribe because we will be doing them for this entire year. And I hope you enjoy. Uh, for day 15, I got rid of 15 clothes hangers. For day 15, I got rid of three shirts, a coffee mug, a patch, an old pair of glasses, two thermoses, a broken baby monitor, a pair of sew-on suspenders, an old printer cartridge, some scented talcum powder, a kit, a cat brush, a broken light, and a broken watch. Side, I have one bath mat that is a pain in the butt to wash and it doesn't even feel soft anymore. Two sweaters, two pairs of pajama pants, two vases, an air freshener that I don't really like the smell of and we're trying to go less chemicals, and two large plates, four medium sized plates, and two bowls from a set that I've held on to because it's not damaged but we also don't use. I have nine books. Uh, I've read, I've either read most of them or I've had them for so many years I'm not going to read them. Two notebooks, a old paint covered shirt, two tins that I got Bluetooth earbuds in, uh, a set of old actual earbuds, buds, actual earbuds and then my coffee cup from my time aboard the USS Peleliu. So today on my side, I have 17 children's clothing items. I was doing their laundry and I was feeling really overwhelmed by the amount that I had to do and so I just did it. A tree skirt, a bundle of rope that got tangled up last year that I didn't untangle, a luggage strap, two um, electrical outlets that were extra from our recent construction, our deceased cat's water dish, as well as some kitty treats, an extra stocking, three hangers, a uh, extra beanie, and some assorted clothes. All right, so on my side, I have 18 children's hangers. <clears throat> on my side, I have seven expired food items, nine different uh, cat toys and treats, two and uh, two glass balls. For day 18, I have 18 clothing hangers. I am getting rid of the colored ones and trying to just hold on to white ones. I'm getting rid of three clothing items, three assorted towels, two pot holders, a old survival book that I don't use, an old directory that I don't use, my deceased cat's rabies tag and some more treats, a mesh bag, a uh, extra tape measure, another glass orb, a, another bag, a piece to a tool that I didn't, I don't know where it actually goes to, an old Nerf gun, and tire sealant that I don't have the other parts to. For day 20, I have kids clothing again. And don't worry, they're not running out. For day 20, I have eight large zip ties, two shirts, five ties, a pair of house shoes, pack an old package of disinfecting wipes, a Sensi burner that we broke the top piece like the day we got it, a bin, and um, an attachment to a concealed carry holster for a gun I don't even have. Yeah, that Sensi thing actually makes me really angry. I bought it the day that I received it. I opened the box, the little top melter plate fell onto the ground and I was literally pregnant with my six-year-old when that happened, and I have never used it properly since. 
ever once in its entire life have I used it. But I've held on to it because I liked it. So it's day 21 and I think for week four we're gonna have to start putting leaves in the table in order to finish. Um, I have 24 of my clothing items and some of the harder things to get rid of were workout apparel and if you know me I don't do that and I have enough I don't need those they're uncomfortable um, this green shawl I got in Okinawa Japan when I lived there but there's some torn pieces that got ripped in my dryer and I can't repair them and I don't have time to figure it out and it makes me really sad but it is what it is um, two camp signed camp shirts I will be taking a short clip of them just so that I can remember them but I don't need to hold on to them and most of them I probably don't even remember the people that wrote most of those signatures because I took everyone's signature and then this pink dress I've been wanting to look nice for so long but it's just one of those dresses you can't wear a bra with and it's also very see-through and it makes me very sad I have an old Halloween costume, two t-shirts, some uh, shirt stays, they go around your thighs, three ties, a piece, an extra piece to my jacket that broke, 11 books, and a bin. So I apologize for the quality change in my camera, because this is not my camera, this is my husband's cell phone, because my camera has been dropped and no longer works and it's in the camera doctor right now but I wanted to continue with the challenge and moving forward so I have eight hangers three Christmassy garland type things that go around candles and then that I... would be how much clothing the rest is clothing but I've reached exactly 22 items the rest is clothing on my side, I have a set of 20 gold clad bars that I mistakenly bought from a police auction website and then one extra from the same website and then the case making a total of 22 items. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed our decluttering videos and then maybe we've inspired you. Um, I feel much better in my house, in my space. Um, we're currently, right now, as of this take, we're in month two, and our house is feeling much better. Um, again, if you're interested in these kind of videos, we'll be doing them every week for the year of 2019, so please subscribe, hit the like button if you did like it so that I know that I'm on the right track, and I hope to see you in next week's video.